Come on. Come on. We have a turbocharger. All he has is like, what, 1,200 horsepower? Holy... What is going on guys, Devin here, aka Misspelled Rebel, and welcome back to the mainland. Uh, we're playing some Forza Horizon 2, however, we are not on Storm Island for the first time in a while here. Uh, we, well, we, well, 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 we, well, we, well, we, well, 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 no, I don't know, shut up. Um, I came back to the mainland because there was the new car pack DLC. Oh, shit. Shit, I almost lost that. That was pretty good, though. Um, I came back to the mainland because I wanted to drive the new Nismo car. And I ended up buying this VW Scirocco. And, I mean, look at how sick this thing looks. Come on. This car. But we do have this event to do, so we're going to hit this up. And then after that, we will get into the Nismo something i don't know what it's called it's the nissan nismo something uh but we'll get into that and show that off a little bit and uh hopefully do a whole tournament in it because i think it looks pretty freaking badass I'm, not, I'm racing a cargo plane in a jaguar both have to hit all the same points Fuck yeah and the turning circle on that thing is huge well no shit the turning circle is going to be enormous all right Let's do it, Ben. Oh, look at those sexy bitches. Here we go. Here we go. I don't see the cargo plane. Oh, there it is. Who the hell owns a cargo plane and said we could borrow it for this? Holy shit, this car does not turn. Wow. Horrible. Horrible on the fucking water. Jesus. Oh, great. And it looks like we're going to have plenty of turns to have to go through. That's phenomenal. Oh. Come on, keep it in a straight fucking line. There we go. That was actually a good gentle turn. I like that. That was not. Come on, come on. I'm not gonna lose to a fucking cargo plane. Actually, from my experience with this game, we'll probably end up being very, very close at the finish line. Unless I absolutely fuck up. We'll be very close at the finish line and I'll win by like three seconds or two seconds or something like that. It'll be something incredibly close. Wow, we're about to pass him. Whoa. Alright, this is a cool race. This is a really cool race. That thing got close. Air traffic control has to be shitting their pants right now. This is cool as hell. Come on. We gotta be smooth. I do have to apologize too if I do sound a little bit congested. Um, I swear to God, if I get sick again, I'm going to murder somebody. But, <clears throat> I'm starting to feel it, but I'm, I'm taking vitamins and stuff to try and stay healthy. I don't know what to do. If you're a doctor, please prescribe me something. Maybe a certain medical card might help. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I think that might be the last thing you want to do when you're congested is smoke something. Actually, my one friend is a really horrible story. I probably shouldn't be saying this, but 
<laughs> his cure for every time he feels congested is to do, uh, I don't know if you guys know what that southern whiskey is that they sell. It's basically whiskey spiced with hot sauce. Yeah, he does a shot or two of that. And he says it clears him right up. And, uh... <laughs> I, I don't think that that's a fantastic idea. In no way do I really condone that. But hey, you know what? To each his own, you know? It's your own choice. Oh my god, if we don't fucking beat this thing, I'm gonna be pissed. Come on. Come on. We have a turbocharger. All he has is like, what, 1,200 horsepower? Holy shit, that was epic. <laughs> I have to admit, I didn't think you had a chance in this one. Yep. You were like a man possessed chasing him down. Oh, possessed by speed. <laughs> we have $6.6 .6 million. What are we going to spend that on? Eventually, I want to buy every car in the game. Uh, because I'm pretty sure that's going to be an achievement. Because it has... Well, it hasn't been an achievement in every other game. It's been an achievement to own one car from each class. And usually it's an achievement to like buy every Ferrari or something like that. Um, I'm guessing it's probably the same thing where it's, you know, own every Ferrari or own every... It's probably going to be Ferrari because Ferrari has like the most expensive cars. I believe the 250 GTO on its own is like 6.3 million in this game. So that will basically wipe out my entire... Oh no, maybe it's 5.3. Even so, that's a lot of money to spend right, on one guys, car. You have a couple of choices now. You can either meet up at the Nice Messina hub and we'll head back out on the road trip. Or you can head over to the Nice ferry port where we've got a boat coming to take us to Isola della Tempesta. To what? Is he just talking about Storm Island? I don't know. Well, he said the port. Pretty sure. Well. Huh. I'm guessing he was just saying Storm Island in Turn around when it is some exotic so. tongue. But yeah, check out this freaking VW Scirocco. What a beast of a car. I would love to drive this car in real life. Especially if it's been modified like I've modified this one. Yeah, fuck your Ford Bronco. Because, I mean, like, this thing is turbocharged, and I believe I made it all-wheel drive instead of just the front-wheel drive is what it was, I believe. And crashed into the finish line. All right, let's go to the garage. Nope, to the hey, auto show. Going? What can I do to help you? And buy the new Nismo car. And then we will continue the thing. I'll drive hey, it all man, the way there. Where though. you been keeping yourself? I think it might be under Nismo. So we'll go all the way down to N. N. Mini Cooper. There it is. Oh, it's under Nissan. For future reference for you guys. It's under Nissan. Um, instead of changing the color, we're just going to stick with the stock paint job. Because it looks pretty fucking cool. And I'm actually pumped to look at the interior. Because I do... I, I'm not going to lie to you guys. I do own this car already. This is the second one I'm buying. Uh, but all I did on the other one, I upgraded it. And then didn't drive it. Because I wanted to drive it first on camera. That and there wasn't a championship for me to really go do. So, um, no, we want to get into track toys. Uh, yes, track toy championship. Yes, yeah, see, I have another one. I upgraded to an A class, but I haven't driven it yet. <clears throat> I want to. That's probably the one that we're going to drive for this championship. Uh, but I just wanted right. to try out the stock one. Let's get inside. Oh. Now, for the next leg, we're heading what over an to interior. Castelletto. And remember, this isn't about the race. It's all about the open road. Look Enjoy at the... It. Is that yards, really supposed to be right. a mirror? I don't know what the fuck that is. See that? I'm right in front of my hand right there on the right-hand side. I have no clue what the fuck that is. It looks kind of like it's supposed to be a mirror. But, because of that, I don't actually have mirrors. 
It actually, you know what it looks like? It looks like an LED spotlight. It does not look like a wing mirror at all. Turn right. Oh, wow. I did not think I was going to be able to get out of that one. Look at how cool it looks, though. I mean, don't get me wrong. It looks ridiculous. It looks just... <coughs> it's kind of ugly, to be honest with you. However, I think ugly cars can sometimes be the coolest because nobody wants to buy the first an ugly car. You know what I mean? Everyone wants a car that looks great. So there is some beauty in owning a car that's completely ugly. I drive pretty much every single day, a Scion XB, which if you don't know what that is, it looks just like the Nissan Cube. It's just a big box. However, that car is fun as hell. It's got some good tires on there, it's got good grip, horrible speed, looks ridiculous, but has a lot of headroom and footroom. It's a phenomenal car, especially if you have like a family or a big dog, which I have both. It's a phenomenal car. And it's great on gas. I uh, took a road trip out west two years ago now, two or three years ago now, and uh, drove that the whole way out there and got like 40 miles to the gallon the whole way out there, which in my opinion is pretty phenomenal, especially since my muffler is not exactly the best for fuel economy. Get out of my way, you fucking BM. Like bowel movement, not BMW. Although, I don't think I've driven the BMW M3 in this game, and I feel like that would be a fun car to drive for the next championship. Although, I want to go out, the final championship, I want to go out with a bang. Like, I want to get in, like, a great car. So, if you have any suggestions, please leave them in the comments down below, because I have a feeling that... I know there's going to be like one last championship and then there's going to be one more for like the grand finale where it's just going to be insane. But I want to be driving like the coolest car ever in order to do that. So like a Fiat 500 maybe? No, I'm just kidding. But uh, yeah, leave me a comment down below what you guys want to see or if you have any suggestions of a car that you think is just like the coolest, let me know. Hey, one of the uh, Storm Island cars came over. He caught the ferry, apparently. What do we got up here? Is that a... Oh, it's a Mustang. I think. I don't know how we're keeping up with this Mercedes. Maybe it's the turns. Maybe... Because this thing, actually, you have to admit, this thing takes turns like a champ. Like, I did not let off the gas at all for that turn, and it just powered through. The only times this car has really fucked up has been when I have failed it. Wow, you fucking bitch. Really? What is this sign? Horizon Festival. Interesting. I don't think that that's been there the whole time. I could be wrong, and I probably am. But I do not recall that ever being there. Woo, this thing can drift a little bit. That Lamborghini Veneno, too, is fast as hell. And it grips like no other car in that game. That is the, in my opinion, without tuning, like, the best stock car. Uh, well, st as far as stock cars go in this game, that car has the absolute best handling out of all of them. It's phenomenal. Oh, that's why every time I do like an S2 race online, always in the Lamborghini. Did all these guys slow down just for me? Oh, let me just blow right past you. Stupid. Are you? Oh, no, you're in a Camaro. I thought he was in the Nismo, too. Let's get this corner. Get the corner. Get the corner. Get the corner. Fucking they were going wide. Woo, but we didn't hit the wall. There we go. There's a good one. There's a good one. What up, K-Trip Superlight? Don't you be bump drafting me, you piece of shit. Alright. We are just about there. And we're- Oh, wall. I shouldn't have looked down. I just had to look down because I know I have class today. And... 
I'm doing this recording before my class. So I'm just trying to make sure I don't run out of time. Which I basically have. Um, shit. Sorry guys, thank you for watching if you did. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more. We're driving the Nismo in the next one. I'm sorry if you just got a little bit of a taste of it in this one. Um, but in the next one, we'll be driving it for the entire race, obviously. And uh, yeah, I'll see you then. Thanks for watching. Peace!